and welcome to another day of Sky VBS. Today we'll be making a hot air balloon craft. So to make this craft, we'll need your four hot air balloon coloring pages, yarn, tape, hole punch, but that's okay if you don't have it, scissors, markers, crayons, or anything else you want to color with, stickers, and anything else you want to use. I have some fancy tape here. So first, we're going to take our hot air balloon pages and we're going to cut them out. But save the scraps. Okay, I have all my balloons cut out and with one of the extras that I have, I'm going to cut a rectangle out to make a 3D basket. There we go. Just save that. And we don't need this, so I'll clean that up later. So first we want to fold our hot air balloons in half. This will make them look 3D later on. Just like that, and we're going to repeat that with all our balloons. So now we're going to color our balloons. I have some markers here. Let's see. I'm going to use this pink color. No, I'm not. <laughs> bye. bye. Yeah, bye. I'm only going to color half of my balloon, so I have a whole bunch of different colored sections. Let's see. How about an orange? I wonder how high hot air balloons can fly. Hey Siri! How high can hot air balloons fly? Here's what I found from wikipedia.org. Hot air balloons are able to fly to extremely high altitudes, 68,986 feet. Okay, and there we go. So Siri said 6,000 feet is the highest a hot air balloon has ever flown. That's pretty high. Hey cameraman. Yes. What's your favorite color? Blue. Blue? Light blue? Yeah. Okay. Thank you for your input. Yes. Sky blue. Sky blue? That works because this is all sky. Oh, yeah. <laughs> this one's dead. 3D. Woo! That one looks close, right? Sure. <laughs> hey, cameraman. Uh, I need another color. Green. Green, okay. Not that one. It's sad you're an artist and you can't even pick a color. <laughs> There's just too many colors. Okay. We have all four of our balloons colored in and our basket. So if you have stickers at home you want to use, or if you have some fancy tape too, you can use that now. I have colored and decorated all of my pieces. So next, you'll want your glue stick. So we're going to fold our pieces again. We're going to take our glue stick and we're going to glue them together. Right on top of each other. Just like that. See? 
we're going to keep going. Okay. On this last one, we're still going to glue. We're going to open up our balloon and glue the first piece to the last piece that we just glued. Press it down. Okay. So you can open it up and it's a 3D hot air balloon. Next, we're going to take our basket and our tape. We're going to roll our basket into a circle. We're going to take our tape and tape it so it stays. Then we're going to take our scissors, our hole punch, our yarn, and our balloon. We're going to hole punch the top of the hot air balloon. If you don't have a hole punch, that's okay, you can just tape it. I'm going to cut a small piece of the yarn, about that much. And we're going to thread it through the top of the balloon, and we're going to tie it. just like that. And we're also going to hole punch the bottom of the hot air balloon. All these confetti. And we're also going to hole punch the sides of our basket. Or you could just use tape. That might be easier. Then I'm going to cut a larger piece of yarn, like this, and I'm going to thread it through the bottom of the hot air balloon. I'm going to thread it through one side of the basket, and tie it, and through the other. And there we go, there's my finished hot air balloon, it's 3D, and it's ready to hang up in your home. Thank you for joining with me today, I hope you had fun, bye! Wanna throw purple at me? <laughs> yeah, I'll just be like, woo! <laughs> Sky marker next! <laughs>